in this video, I'm going to be reviewing a newer AI writer called Chibi.ai. Chibi is slightly different to the other writers that I reviewed, including Jarvis and Writer, in that Chibi has got a different algorithm and it is not as restricted as the other AI tools in that it allows you to talk about different topics and some censored topics and so on. So I know with Jarvis, I had some issues when I mentioned some keywords where it would stop writing and would come with an error. And I confirmed it with uh, Jarvis support that it was restricted on their end. And I think it was an open AI issue anyway, but um, anyway, so Chibi is, is slightly different in that it's more focused on the writing experience and for people who are writing, they want to expand what they're writing with an AI tool. So it's not like uh, my favorite tool, which is Article Forge, which is just goes out, grabs grabs the uh, content, and you can just use it as it is, or just spin it around a bit. Uh, this is more for people who are writing a lot of content, and they just need some guidance for them more information as they're writing. Sorry. Okay. So, like I said, the Chibi is an online writing tool that helps you develop your ideas by harnessing the power of artificial intelligence. So you can write more powerful content and connect with your reader. I'll show you the interface in a second, but this is it's a very simple interface. Um, so yes, I signed up uh, about a month ago. I think this is just my, still my first month. Um, when it was released to, I think it was in the Facebook group and it was a beta release. And yeah, I've used it a little bit. I haven't used it as much as I should have. But um, I'm using it a bit, I meant to do a review a while ago. And it's similar to Jarvis boss mode, but the content output I think is a little bit better. And the experience is a little bit better too. Um, that's only if, if, if you're using as a writing tool. Like Jarvis is, I don't know, you, um, uh, Jarvis is slightly different. Because Jarvis you get a lot more... Um, what they call templates to work with that so there's loads in there so it depends what you want to do um, I use Jarvis for answering uh, Quora questions for creating a uh, product profiles uh, user profiles and for writing blog posts and so on and Chibi is like that it also is good for writing article for article writing blog post writing um, I'll show you inside the the, the, uh, the control panel um, let me see. Here's a lot going on here. Okay, let's get into the pricing. So the pricing right now is uh, fifty nine dollars a month for for the full access. So that you see, there's no toxic toxicity <laughs> filter of unlimited use with uh, unlimited words. Sorry, with fair use. Now, I remember when Jarvis was a few months ago, they had completely unlimited boss mode plan and people were really they were using bots and automated content it was really killing the system and it caused a lot of issues for their for their network so they had to include uh, include some limits so you do get limited words but but with uh, Chibi you have to use the Google login and you can't it's, there's no multiple logins so it's one account can be logged in at a time and so like I, I just had one open in one browser and I tried to open it again in my other browser other account and it wouldn't let me open it. It didn't say it on the screen, but I figured out that it's because you only had one login. They are going to include a Teams feature soon, they said. But at the moment, it's one user, one login. And so it's $59 a month if you pay monthly. And that's full access to everything. Or if you pay annually, it works at $49 a month, which is $588 a year. And there is a limited plan, which is $39 a month, and you get 35,000 words. Now, I'll be honest, 35,000 words is not that much, depending on what you do. But even when I'm, when I'm testing, I can use 10, 15,000 words. So I'd, I'd always go for this this plan, the $59 plan, or the annual plan. Um, there's no free trial per se, because they want to stop abuse. Because obviously, every, every word that's written costs money, costs credits. So they don't want people to come and abuse the system. But there is a seven-day uh, refund policy. And there's no PayPal, it's Stripe only. And you have to have a uh, Google account. Okay. Okay, 
So let me show you inside the panel. Let me get out that one. Um, so I've written a few test documents. So this is the actual main dashboard, which is very basic. Um, you've got new document, your document that you've written. You go into your account to change your plan or whatever. You, they just added a course. So you can go through the whole process step by step on how to write content, help and community. So this is a document that I had open before. So let me show you about show you around the control balance. You can add tags to your to your uh, documents so you can quickly find them. This is your title and this is the text area. So let me go to article. So you do article, copywriting or persona. So article is standard, article, blog post, so on. Copywriting is for products, for advertising, ads, and so on. And you have all the various tools on the side. I'll go through that in a second. And then persona is if you're writing, uh, you want to relate to a certain audience and so on, you can use the persona setting. I'm not really sh that sure how to use it because I haven't used it yet. But that's not what I'm, what I'm using Chibi for. Uh, you've got save, auto save, undo any AI content that or any AI process that you've done previously or the last step. Um, copy is to copy all the content. Um, this one is a sh paragraph shredder. So you can basically simplify a paragraph or make it shorter. And, well, if you copy some content in and you want to uh, rewrite it, you can use paragraph shredder. Um, this is the list cleaner. Okay, I don't know what that does actually. Let me see what it does. Okay, it made the list into it made it into a uh, a little paragraph. Uh, this one is the cut. So if you want to break up your large content into uh, short sentences, that's this. It's called mobile cut, and this is the title case. So make uppercase, lowercase, and so on. So this is the main area you're going to work in. Now on the right hand side here, where you see write, um, this one's called. And this one should give you, um, I forgot what it's called. Let me see, I made some notes. That is called Pathways. So it gives you, uh, I think normally two or maybe more options on how to continue your, from where you from where you stopped. And this is the sentence finishing option. So in this box here, this is the important box. This is where you write your content. So if you can see, put your mouse over this eye. Um, this is like, this is what Chibi understands. Hi Chibi, please write about uh, what is the juice diet and uh, what was are the what are the benefits and what are the benefits and pitfalls. Okay, so let me just start from down here. I click on write. Okay, it didn't write because it's a blank area and it obviously because it's written some stuff. So let me just show you from here. So this is what I wrote before. Um, I should have used seed, but I think I just don't use right. So let me just click on seed. So that would be like the uh, some content to get you started. Okay, I can carry on. So if I press space and then right. Okay, that's a, that's a good meaty portion of the text there. So if I want an outline, so it will use this content box to give me an outline. So I can break my document up into these. Um, I can use these headers. So what is the juice tire? How do juice tires work? What are the potential dangers? And so on. So this is actually really good content. And from there, I can use these headings. And then. Um, use right. Do I need to do brackets? I don't. Okay. I think it's, it's it's done this because of these. So I think if I do this, um, which one is it? Smart lock. Okay, smart lock. And click right. I don't have information there. Okay, it needs a bigger sentence. Let me delete those. Now I do smart lock. Okay, smart lock. I'm. Uh, so wherever you are in your document, you can use Smart Lock to create more content around that 
those sentences. So, for example, if I wanted to write more about 0.5 here, if I want to write it up here, I can do smart lock around this this sentence, these two sentences, put my cursor here, and then click write. So we use that information to write more content. So let's see if this works now. Okay, right. Okay, there we go. I don't know what it's doing there, but anyway, that wasn't the best example of smart lock. Okay, it's not good because I've really started in the middle of a document, but I'm just going to give you a quick, uh, quick overview. Okay, headlines. So we'll look at the content and give me some headlines to use. So this could be a good uh, long tail heading. That's interesting. What what do juice eaters eat? Okay, and then questions. So I'm gonna add some questions in there. These are all possible questions. And yeah, all the content does make sense. It does give some pretty good output. And I do actually quite like it with liking. I do like writing with Jarvis. I'm calling it Jarvis, it's Chibi, I'm so sorry, it's Chibi, not Jarvis. I'm obsessed with Jarvis, okay. Now let's look at copywriting. Um, copywriting, so let me go down a bit. So copywriting, you get all of the uh, the popular copywriting frameworks. So attention, interest, desire, action, ADA, uh, PASS, PIS, and BAB. So it will use this this is really important because you can use this throughout your documents so if you're if you've got a particular keyword or phrase or content that you want to focus chibi on you can it's, it's, it's important to use this uh, box up here to uh, to get chibi to write in context so this is mainly for marketing and advertising you can use it you can use it to grab attention you can use it to make give more interest about a product or item whatever you're writing about desire action you can write about problems so the problem here you can maybe write about weight loss or dieting or overweight or obeseness and if that's a word and then you can write about that as a problem let me see if so what are the what are the health risks or what kind of spell Okay, so that's that, and then we'll go to problem. Okay, it's not using that box, maybe I'm using it wrong. Okay, weight loss. Problem maybe actual juice, and we can do you can this button here to end the sentence. So this is like a unique feature that's not in Jarvis or any other tools I've used, where you can just use that to just end the sentence. It doesn't go on and on and write lines and lines. We just finish sentence. So it finishes there with a full stop for the period. Okay, it's fine. Uh, let me find another sentence. Let me try it here. In this, in this, uh, in this fast See, so I did a couple of words and ended it right there. So that's handy if you don't have to end your sentence. Uh, persona, I don't really use much. So I'm only talk about that. So anyway, this is Chibi. Actually, I want to show you one other thing. Um, now, with the toxicity filter, I noticed with Java, I couldn't mention certain words. Um, I don't know if I should mention it on, on YouTube, but. So I couldn't talk about religion, I couldn't talk about uh, world events and so on because it was filtered on the Java side and I think it could have been on the the the, uh, the OpenAI side but let me see, I did create a good document so I wrote about this here and I wrote 220 words with just I think two clicks and yeah so if you've got like these sort of topics that you want to write about or even stuff like health and um, I can't think of any other things. 
But stuff in general, I mean, my Chibi is more unrestricted than other, is the most unrestricted AI writer. So, I mean, this is, this is, is it's a really handy tool and you can go down more avenues than with just Jarvis or Writer or any of the other tools. So, hope you found this uh, useful. Um, let me know if you use any of the other tools or if you, if you do pick up Chibi. There is a link below. It's not an affiliate link because there's no affiliate program at the moment. I think that's why there's not many reviews about Chibi because there's no affiliate program. <clears throat> Everyone's pushing Jarvis and all the other ones. But Chibi is probably the most unique and it's got a lot of potential and it's half the price of Jarvis. Um, but my opinion is, I mean, I like Chibi for writing the for writing blog posts, but I prefer Jarvis for writing for all the templates. I, I don't, I'm not a great writer, so I like using templates just to get to the point. And Jarvis is handy for that, so I'm not going to keep both. So I'll decide in, in a month or so which one I'm keeping. And yeah, hope you found it useful. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.